Are you ready? This is the return of summer boardwalk magic. Pure magic. It's like the magical candle. It's so good. So here we have the 2013 limited edition summer boardwalk three wick. And the description says, like memories of the best summer spent at the beach, caramel glazed popcorn, warm taffy apples, and salted sweet cream. Summer boardwalk is the cream of the crop. It's regarded in the candle world as one of the most powerful candles ever. It's ridiculous. It just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. It's so strong. I can't even tell you. So as you can see, flawless perfection. The burn is amazing. Let's get into the performance portion and then go into the scent because I have a lot to say. So you're witnessing a second day burn. I was going to do third or fourth day, but the requests start coming in, so I figured go ahead, knock it out, and post it. So the wicks are not thick, they're not thin, they're medium-sized, straw-colored wicks. These wicks are excellent. They burn from start to finish, top to bottom, with no problems whatsoever, so I'm really happy about that. And the wicks were kind of long, so I made sure to trim them halfway so that I could get the best burn and performance out of it. And I lit the candle. The first day I lit it for about, let's say, maybe f three to four hours. And the wax melted and pulled out about in about, let's say, 15 minutes. And the scent throw kicked in. I didn't even need to light it. I'll get to that in a second, but the scent throw was already there and it really started kicking into gear in about I'll say maybe God 15 minutes everything kind of fell together kicked into gear in about 20 minutes top to get you know that potent strong throw that we all know from this candle so that was the first day and the wicks are just they're perfect I'm not even kidding the flames let me show you really quickly give you an overhead view of it dancing oh so wickedly and viciously high so pretty and when your flames are that high that's always going to secure a great burn um, the wicks did not form mushroom tops this time around and the mushroom top for those of you that just don't know it's a little bitty ball of soot that forms at the tip of the wick and that always helps to ensure that the flames are going to get a lot bigger and thicker and wider and that's going to melt your wax a lot more consistently and smoothly um, hopefully from start to finish so that's always great and this is on we're on day two now and the burn has been pretty much same consistency so the burn has just been great again I wanted to do this on like a third or fourth day but I'm pretty confident that the candles gonna do great from start to finish and if anything changes I'll definitely let you know in the con or in the um, info box or I'll just do like an after the burn review and let you know what happened but I think we're good so far so good so the performance is crazy and let me tell you about last night so I had my candle lit you know pretty much all night and I blew it out the scent lingered very strong from last night up until this morning when I had it when I lit it relit it and they nailed it this is the perfect candle because the last time around I didn't want to like nitpick too much or complain but what happens is that when you have a candle that's like caramel scented um, the after scent usually lingers and it lingers into like this kind of icky buttery scent this time around it retained its caramel um, glazed apple tone it didn't seem buttery or icky it was excellent so I don't know if I'm smelling the candle today or if I'm smelling the after scent but I'm telling you this candle lingered from here to Mexico it's crazy now let's talk about of course the throw oh boy I went outside I was watering the lawn and you know messing with the little flowers or whatnot I could smell it door shut go back inside crazy I did a little experiment I went down the street I came I could smell it seriously like 
15 minutes after I closed the door, it's it lingered all the way out, not even being sarcastic or, um, you know, overdoing it, but it really lingered all the way outside. I have the doors closed shut, and right now I'm cornered, I can't move, I'm choked out, and I love every minute of it, it's so good. So, of course it's strong in here, but the magic part is that it lingers into every single one of the rooms. Um, it's only been downstairs. I was doing a lot of cleaning down here, so I figured, let me just light it down here. Of course I couldn't move, it was so strong, but I had the door shut closed, and this scent lingered all over the house. I have the um, espresso bar wallflower in my bathroom, and that's, you know, strong enough. This candle literally fought with that wallflower. It's that strong. I had a eucalyptus candle burning in my living room. I had to blow it out because it clashed. It didn't stink, but it was like eucalyptus caramel. I don't think I'm ready for that blend, but I had to blow that out. It lingered into my room. It lingered all over. So it's it's pure magic. Like I said, this is the one that's regarded as like the best of the best as far as, you know, across the board. So excellent throw, excellent performance. We're great. Now the actual scent. So, I get a very rich, decadent, and creamy caramel scent. They say taffy apples. I don't really get that. I get more of, like, a candy apple glaze, because there's, like, this glazed note in it. I'm getting, like, a glaze apple scent. And, of course, you know, the caramel popcorn scent that's always there and sweet cream is definitely there that's one that I you throw sweet cream into anything I'm going to be all over it so love that to the max it's great but I love the scent because I feel like it's transitional and it doesn't cater to any season whatsoever you can burn because let's think about it caramel is a scent that you know people love anytime you know it doesn't have to be fall summer spring winter you know think of it like this and like the spring summer it's like a rich kind of like candy popcorn type scent you know fun fun and then you get into fall and winter and it could be you know a nice warm comforting scent so caramel to me it's just any time of the year it doesn't really matter and total mass appeal that's what this candle is it's complete mass appeal if you weren't into it last year and you feel like you want to try it this year definitely give it a shot um to me, this candle wouldn't be guest friendly, especially if you have those um, friends and family members that are like, oh God, what's that? You know, even like the little scents get to people. So I wouldn't recommend the scent being something that you'd have burning when you have people around and they're like, oh God, what's that? Because it's going to choke you out. It's crazy strong. On the flip side, if you like, you know, scents that will take over, you're definitely going to like this one. Off top, no joke. It's so good. Um, in the candle world, a lot of us agree that it was good, but it was just too much. So no one really stated that it, you know, didn't smell good or, you know, wasn't a great, good quality, in good quality. It just was too much for certain people. And a lot of people, you know, everyone's not going to like caramel or, but it's safe to say no one reported this candle as being a dud or, you know, to this or to that maybe too strong for some but that's a good thing in my book so that is pretty much all I have to say about summer boardwalk um, I opened it from the package and it literally scented the entire box I had the candle when I was doing the review yesterday um, the hall I could smell it very strong very potent so even with the lid close you can still smell it it's the best I can't stress that enough it's just something you have to have super good high quality total mass appeal you gotta get it so with that being said I'm going to let you guys go thank you so much for listening and watching you have to comment rate and subscribe that's mandatory at this point it's a must you, you gotta do it you just have to and as always God bless you and I'll talk to you all soon thanks love you much bye